Hello, Fly Babies. It's me, Fly Lady Cat, and I'm here today to give you peace in your life, control in your home, and to learn how to finally love yourself. Today, we are on Mission 10 of Cruising Through the Holidays. So far, we've gone through two weeks, so this is the end of the second week. I will put a recap out tomorrow, which will go over the second week again. Okay, so what do we talk about on Fridays during Cruising Through the Holidays? Finances. So get out your Cruising Through the Holiday planner, your planner for the holidays, whatever that might be. Remember when we talked about last week thinking about how much you wanted to spend for Christmas? We're going to readdress that today and really decide who's going to get how much spent on them, and then you're going to start spending. So you're going to go out next week and buy some things. You want to, you want to make sure you keep your receipts. Remember I said to put a little packet in there that you can keep your receipts in, like tape an envelope, that's what I did in mine, uh, and keep receipts in, or maybe print out your Amazon receipts. You don't have to print those out, but you want, the idea is you wanna make sure you're not going over. So you wanna make sure you have it checked off when you've spent. Now, there's another thing you wanna do, and that's you don't wanna go into debt. You don't want to have a credit card bill come due in January, and that's, a, that's just a yucky way to start off the year, and it's just not a good way to have peace in your life. You also wanna try not to borrow from your savings account unless you have a specific one for the holidays. And on that point, let me say that I would recommend at this point right here, right now, as a banker, I would recommend that you open a special savings account if you don't already have one, not the family savings account, not your emergency fund. This is a separate account called a holiday fund. And if you decide this year you need to spend just arbitrarily $600, let's say that's how much you're going to spend, well, then you're going to deconstruct that. And over 12 months, that means you're going to spend $50, say $50 a month. That comes down to $12.50 a week. Can you do that? If you do that every single week or, or two weeks, $25, or once a month, $50, then at this time next year, your savings account will have $600 in it. And you can have the money to spend. You won't pull it all out at once. You can pull out part of it. Keep saving because you're going to have the year after that and reassess, you know, do I need more next year? Do I need less the next year? And, and continue saving. So you're always putting money in, but you'll have the lump sum that you need at this time of the year next year. Okay? All right, that's it for today. You're going to have a beautiful holiday. Don't forget, it's about giving, not receiving. And the biggest gift of all was the gift of our Savior on Christmas morning. That's what we're celebrating. Have a wonderful day, and remember that you are beautiful. Bye.